Someone on Reddit asked what is good world building? Is it attention to detail? The size of the world? Realism regarding the way the world operates? This is my favorite book. Now nah, all it takes is to be a hole in the ground. You don't have to know anything about it, it just needs wonder and mystery. I haven't read it, but I can say it's my favorite book ever. As long as it's huge and you never know enough, no matter how far you are into the story, then it's amazing! It's on the top of my list. I mean, why would you appreciate it for sticking to whatever it has established early on, instead of constantly pulling random bullshit out of nowhere? Random bullshit will keep you guessing, because you can never predict what comes next! I'm so happy! In all seriousness, being big means nothing if it's empty. The size of a desert doesn't matter if there is nothing in the desert. Similarly, being mysterious doesn't mean anything if there is nothing to uncover. Wondering what is out there has nothing to do with world building, it's just the feeling of adventure. The map you see here is the first island from my book, and although it's not the best, it covers all the basics of good world building. First of all, it is detailed, in the sense there is something on it. It is not a huge question mark with invisible areas and cities. Every area has its own geography, history, lore, traditions and system of government. It doesn't make you wonder what is going on, you know it. It's detailed and that is what makes it good. A second feature of good world building is when it's interactive. That means every area is affected and affects the areas around it. They are not isolated pocket dimensions where what happens in one city does not affect the others. For the same reason it's dynamic, meaning it's not frozen in time, it slowly changes as years go by because of the events that happen in it. And the third and last feature of good world building is consistency. It can't be random ideas that don't seem to fit and change randomly whenever the author feels like it. You cannot throw in magic in a setting that for years didn't have any, and you cannot use magic in ways that differ from what has been established. It's an aspel when it happens and breaks the immersion. There is no right or wrong way to write a story. Everything is okay. 